Cody brought perspectives on the FLDS and Warren Dubs. After Sister White debuted it in 2010, the bras became the poster children for polygamy. Cody Ross says the FLDS practices are not his beliefs. Cody highlights the contrast between the FLDS and the Apostolic Unity Brethren, a fundamentalist Mormonism sect to which they belong. When people hear the phrase Mormon fundamentalist, they probably think about a small subset of our population, the Fundamentalist Church of Jesus Christ of Latter-day Saints. For too long, this organization and the handful of abusive men who ran it have been the poster children of polygamy in America. Until recently, the FLDS was run by Warren Dubs, who has been found guilty of child sexual assault and is now serving a life sentence in prison. He ruled his organization with an iron fist, creating a climate rampant with abuse and fear. He not only tolerated but also promoted child brides. He summarily reassigned the wives of men he deemed unworthy to new husbands. These are not my beliefs. This is not my world. Cody brought destroyed by FLDS slander. Cody, a Mormon polygamist, was distressed after the Jeff's case as blurs the popular perspective of polygamists. For the first time in his life, Cody was humiliated to be a polygamist. Cody explained in the book, didn't want to be judged for it. Most of all, I didn't want our children to suffer because their parents had revealed themselves to the world. Cody explained that this show was important and necessary. We needed to step out from the shadow of Warren Jobs and the FLDS, who for too long had been the face of polygamy. We needed to disassociate ourselves from the negative connotations of polygamy. Cody feels the FLDS secrecy enabled Jobs to dominate and mistreat so many people within his church. The Star of Sister Wise wrote, Although my grandfather and his family live a lifetime of fear, he still realized that fear leads to secrecy, and secrecy leads to abuse of power. He advocated for harsher punishment for underage marriages and abusive relationships. He believed that these crimes would be stopped if polygamists could live openly instead of in secrecy. As my grandfather saw it, secret, closed societies were directly responsible for the abuses for which the FLDS has become, sadly, infamous.